Money is an interesting resource, as while there's no denying its importance in the world today, many have misunderstandings about what money offers them and their understanding of it. If you feel you may have some questions about the value of money, then this video will help to clarify some of the common misunderstandings people have about money. So with that said, let's look at some of the most common money myths today. Number 1. Money equals happiness Probably the most common myth about money today is that it brings happiness to people's lives and it's extremely easy to fall into this way of thinking. The issue is that many people will portray the image that with money you can live a life full of happiness and that only a select number of people get to live like this. However, the truth is money in itself doesn't bring happiness into your life. Rather, how you use it is what's of importance, as you can use money in a way that helps you feel happier. This might be to get experiences through travel or doing good deeds with your wealth. The key point here is that money is a resource that you can use and how you use that resource is what's important. Number 2. Money equals less worries Money can provide financial security, in that you're safe in the knowledge that you don't have to live from paycheck to paycheck the more you have available to you. However, money doesn't provide less worries, as often managing it can be a task in itself and there's always the fear of potentially losing all you've worked for. It also won't remove the other worries or stresses in your life, as you'll still have worries related to relationships if you have any sour ones, or if you worry about those you care for, such as your spouse or kids. The fact is, worry is systematically created or controlled through mindset, as there are people with money who are extremely stressed in life, and equally those who don't have money at all who never worry at all. Number 3. Money equals attractive This one is no doubt going to be contentious, but hear me out before jumping on me. Money in itself isn't attractive, but rather what you portray is. If we talk about a man having money, most women aren't seeking money itself, but rather what it tells them about the man. Because money can show financial security, an ability to provide and ambition. It's the qualities that we associate with money that attracts people, and while there are some examples where selfish people seek the money itself, they are usually in a small minority and that's a fact, as most people are happy to settle down with someone with an average or even lower income if they meet the other needs they look for in a partner. Number 4. Money equals friends this is similar to the previous point, in that money can play a part in how people perceive you and how it might represent a part of you. It's an attractive quality as mentioned, because people might make it to mean certain things about you that they are interested in getting to learn more about. However, while money can offer opportunities to help you meet more people in life, what it doesn't do is ensure you make substantial friendships with people. In fact, you're more likely to be hesitant as you doubt people's motives and frankly speaking, you will have people who are only around you because they find your wealth an attractive quality. Number 5. Money equals no debt Possibly the biggest misconception about money in ways, as money doesn't equate to less debt, as it completely depends on how you spend the money. For example, Someone who makes $50,000 a year with a $100,000 mortgage and someone who makes $500,000 a year with a $1 million mortgage have the same debt, because while the latter earns more, they equally spend more too. I've encountered this in my own life, whereby I earn less money than someone I knew, but was financially more secure, as while I'd save and invest carefully with what I did make, they would spend frivolously. So remember. Money is an incredible resource to have and can unlock many possibilities and opportunities in life, but don't fall for the myths commonly associated with money. Have you ever fallen for any of these misconceptions of money? Let me know in the comments section below. Please like, share and subscribe as we help you live life on your terms. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to ensure YouTube notifies you of the latest uploads. Thanks for watching.